Hey guys, Dave from WP Smackdown here, and I just want to take a quick minute to show you two different ways that you can find the WordPress user ID for any user that is registered on your site. So the default way to find it without installing any plugins or, or doing any extra work is just navigate to the users and all users screen. And all you have to do here is hover over any one of the usernames that are listed here for your users. And look down in the bottom left corner of your screen. Um, now I'm using Google Chrome, so it's in the bottom left corner of my screen. If you're using a different browser, it might be over in the bottom right hand corner. But almost every browser is going to show you what the hyperlink to that user, uh, user page is. And so you'll be able to see that down here in the bottom. And you're going to look for the question mark user underscore ID. So in this example, it's equals two. It's always going to be that number after the equal sign. That number is the user ID for that user. If, uh, if that's not working, you can also click on the username and that'll pull up the actual profile page for that user. Then you can look up in the top in your URL bar of your browser and you'll see the same thing there. You'll have a question mark, user underscore ID equals two. Um, so it's always going to be that number that's right after the equal sign. So that's a super quick way to do it. Um, if you need to get a lot of different IDs at once, um, or if you need IDs for posts or pages or need to know other information, um, there's a great plugin that you can use that I'll show you how to use now. So the super simple plugin is called Reveal IDs. If you just search for Reveal IDs, it should be the first one that pops up. You'll see it right here. Um, just make sure you install and activate it, and then I'll show you what it does. So I've jumped back over to the user screen, and what you'll notice here is all the way on the right, there's an additional column for ID. So this makes it even easier, and it just automatically displays it there on the page for every single one of your users in this separate column. There aren't really any options for this plugin. It just simply exposes that ID and does exactly what it says it does. However, if you don't want to show this ID column and you want to hide it temporarily, you can click on screen options, come up here and just uncheck the box for ID and that'll remove the column. So if you temporarily need to move it, you can do that and then just check it again to add it back in uh, for yourself there. The other cool thing that this plugin does is it also reveals the IDs for all of your WordPress posts. So here I only have one, the default Hello World post, but you'll notice it's got ID of one over here. And then same thing for pages, all of the IDs for all of my pages are revealed here in case you need to use those for whatever reason. So I hope that was helpful. If you have any questions, as always, just leave them in the comments. Thanks for watching.